of our ancestors actually making it happen. Nobody tell you nothing different. I am so proud tonight, bro. What should I say this morning? Right here, right here in NO. Uh, this is Brother Troy from Baton Rouge. From Baton Rouge. We got Tina over here. From Baton Rouge. From Baton Rouge, all right? And we from NY, all right? Definitely. Come on down here. We we'll meet up with the family. We're going down to dinner. Hi, my name is Diana Jones. I'm from Harvey, Louisiana. Hi, Cheryl Clayton from New Orleans. Hi, my name is Eliana Jackson. I'm from New Orleans, Louisiana. Grew up in the lower nine water where the devastation happened. And currently live in New Orleans East where we're still rebuilding. Hello, my name is Geneva Caesar and I'm from New Orleans East. My name is Diana Jones, and I live on the West Bank of uh, New Orleans, which is Harvey, Louisiana. My house got flooded. We had about two feet of water. We had to repair our house because the reason why it was flooded because they all left and forgot to turn the pumps on, and that's why my house got flooded. The, the levee breach. Mm -hmm. uh, the levee breach. The, the levee was broken because neglect from government officials not doing what they're supposed to do to maintain the levees. So the hurricane did not do all of the damage by itself. From what I'm understanding, the hurricane had passed. And after the breach, the wind and the tidal surge broke the levees. And that caused my house to have eight feet of water for 15 days. So as of that, I still do not have a home. And currently residing where I was raised in Metairie, back home with my mom. So we are still under construction. So did you lose everything? Everything. Pictures and all? Everything. My house, right now, there is no house. It's just a, a vacant lot. Wow. And how everything many years did you live there before? I lived there five years. Okay. Five years before. And now my daughter and son are living in Mesquite. My son is 16 and he's not coming back, not really ready to come back because they're, the schools are not up and running as they should be because there's still a lot of uh, uncertainties about our city and how we're going to have it to grow. We know it's going to grow and it's going to get better. It's not, it's not going to be as it was. It's going to be better than it was. So we're looking forward, I'm looking forward to that. And hopefully everyone who can come home. Oh, right oh yeah, they should have like yeah, they close, huh? Can somebody come get the money? Walgreens is open. They have any able-bodied men that's doing the gold thing? What are you gonna do? Um yeah, I Listen, 